and three, two, one, now. Hi, I'm Lewis Lightning, and welcome back to Dragon Age Origins. Uh, we just finished Circle Tower, we came to the campsite here, and I was talking to some of the people here. We did some enchanting as well. Uh, before I do anything else, I'm going to quickly get rid of some of these gifts we have. That was one of the main reasons I came back, and I kind of forgot about it. So we have a lot of gifts, really. Um, the Black Grim Roar. Heavy Grim Roar, Bound in Black Leather. Morgan would want to look at this. So we can give that to her. But let's uh, hold off on it for a bit. Andraste's Grace. A small wildflower commonly known as Andraste's Grace. So, I mean, people have talked about these before. Um, and they will talk about them if we haven't talked to them yet. Basically, you can either look at the uh, inspect thing. And, I mean, some, like, a bronze symbol of Andraste. Well, Liliana was part of uh, the ch Chantry, which worships in draw states, so you think that would be useful to her. Although Alistair as well was uh, part of the Chantry at a point. So that's why I mean some gifts are better for some people. That Grim Roar, uh, uh, yeah, a lot of them have certain people to go to. So Beef Bone and Lamb Bone, I mean, who'd want that other than my dog? So I'm going to give them to him. He's already f likes me all the way, so it really makes no difference if I get rid of him. Um, and we'll go talk to someone else now. Stan was kind of pissed off, so we'll save him for later. Uh, let's see what Alistair has to say. What do you need? Do you want to talk about Duncan? You don't have to do that. I know you didn't know him as long as I did. He was like a father to you, I understand. I... <coughs> I should have handled it better. Duncan warned me right from the beginning that this could happen. Any of us could die in battle. I shouldn't have lost it, not when so much is riding on us, not with the blight and... and everything. I'm sorry. There's no need to apologize. I'd like to have a proper funeral for him. Maybe once this is all done, if we're still alive. I don't think he had any family to speak of. What about the other great... or he had you, that's a good one. I suppose he did. It probably sounds stupid, but part of me wishes I was with him, in the battle. I feel like I abandoned him. He you saved your life by sending you to the tower. Yes. I know. I think he came from High Ever, or so he said. Maybe I'll go up there sometime, see about putting up something in his honor. I don't know. Have you had someone close to you die? Not that I mean to pry, I'm just... <laughs> My entire family was murdered just recently. Oh, oh, of course. How stupid <coughs> of me to forget. Here I am going on and on about Duncan, and you... I am so sorry. Thank you. Really, I mean it. It was good to talk about it, at least a little. I'm never going to high ever with you when you go. I'd like that. So would he, I think. It's kind of cool, you can see the electricity in my sword. Hey! And Alistair likes me enough that my minor constitution, I got an ability so that my constitution is better now. So that's good. But you can see my sword's kind of zappy now. It's awesome. Well, let's talk to Liliana. Then I guess we'll hit the wind. Yes. I'd like to talk. Well, here I am. Uh, what was life like in the Chantry Cloister? Quiet. It was a life suited for contemplation. In the cloister, away from the fuss and the flurry of the cities, I found peace. And in that stillness, I could hear the Maker. But it was not perfect. Some of my Chantry fellows were condescending. That is the nature of religious folk, I suppose. Condescending? How so? When I talked about my beliefs, that the Maker reveals himself in the beauty of his world, they treated me with disdain. They want to believe that he's gone. So that when he turns his gaze on them, it means they are special, chosen. He cannot possibly have love for all. The sick and the weary, the beggars and the fools. What did you say to them? What can I say to them? What they believe is what the Chantry says. And the Chantry is infallible, yes? Maybe I am wrong. But it is the Maker's place to decide if I am worthy, not men. Not the Chantry. But there is work to be done. And I have talked enough for now. 
So, Liliana, nothing happened with her. Let's see, win. Oh, it's been a long day. Rest. Rest would be welcome. Uh, are you all right? Yes, yes, of course. I am just a little weary. As you may have noticed, I'm no spring chicken. Very sprightly for your age, though. Thank you. You're very kind to say so. But in all honesty, I do not know how many years I have left in me. I have lived for such a long time. But there is always something else to do. And I have to keep going in order to do it. I think I will be glad when I am done. I'm sure you'll be kicking around for years yet. Oh, I don't know. I really don't. Well, that was kind of depressing. Well, we got minor willpower. Now, this dude here... See these crates? They also appeared. Um, we got a emissary. You get emissaries for each of the main areas you do. The circle tower is one. That's for the mages or templars, depending which way you go. There's uh, the elves will send you one, and the um, dwarves will send you one. So let's talk to him real quick. The circle of magi stands ready to assist, Grey Warden, as do the templars of the Chantry. This guy sounds like a tranquil. Do you need anything? Or they will work together? The sincerity of your cause has drawn them together under a common banner. It would not have happened otherwise. Uh, I want to talk the to The circle again. of Magi stands ready to assist, Grey Warden, as do the Templars of the Chantry. Uh, do you need anything? There are always areas to improve on, Grey Warden. The most useful for my talents are runes. So here is where you need the runes. So you can turn in runes for the circle. Um, I don't want to give him anything. <laughs> I, I haven't really enchanted anything yet, so uh, I want to keep what I have. Maybe I'll get it, you know, use it later. So the only other person to talk to is Sten, and there's that dude over there with the exclamation mark above his head that we ignored before. Let's talk to Sten. Yes. Uh, what were you doing in that cage? Sitting, as you observed. That's not what I meant. It's what you asked. Uh... Just tell me. I did. Parshera, was there anything else? I have a question. <laughs> I am hardly surprised. Why did you come to Ferelde? To answer a question. What was the answer? Were you not at Ostagar when the army was overwhelmed? That is your answer. Uh... Why would the Canary care about the Blight? Why do you? Ferelden is my home. Or, I'm a Grey Warden. It's my job. Exactly. You don't ask, nor do I. The Arashok sends me and I go. Uh, don't you have to report back then? Yes. When are you going to do that? Never. I cannot go home. Uh, you can stay with us. Thank you. Can we move on? We keep the dark spawn waiting. See if I can talk to him. Speak then. I have nothing else then to talk to him about. We move on. Let's go. As you wish. You can actually send him away. It said there. I think you should go. Whoa! Stand improves plus sixteen. That's pretty awesome. Uh, let's talk to this guy. Actually, geez, we haven't really learned anything about gifts. Um, I'm having a hard time remembering what is. Happened in my playthrough and what happened in the other one. Let's talk to this guy. Levy tried. Oh, no, we'll go to my dog. Oh, why you little? What? What? Your furry friend here took offense at me getting near his food. He spat at me. Look. Uh, it was just a warning. He could have taken the hand off. Don't you think I don't know it? Sometimes I forget that he's a war dog. That'll teach me. I didn't want to be mean to Alistair or the dog. Well, that's good enough. Um, so we're going to go back to Red Cliff. So we'll take Alistair. Yes. Oops, not the dog. Win. Yes. 
and Liliana. Indeed. That's a good... I mean, we could take Sten instead of Alistair, but Alistair knows people in Red Cliff. And also, uh, later... Well, maybe later we're going to go to a place where there's magic, so Alistair would be helpful. Wind's a great healer, and we need a rogue to open chests, so that's what we'll take. So we're going to go to Red Cliff. Now, go to the castle. We could get ambushed on the way. So maybe we'll have another fight. I don't know. Well, yep, we're having a fight. We don't really have much room, though, so kind of worried about, uh, you know, our inventory situation. Oh, Denarim. I bring word, sire. There are demands from the Banorn that you step down from the Regency. Bastard, kill my family. They are said to be gathering their forces, as are your allies. It appears it will be civil war after all, despite the Darkspawn. Pity. I also have an interesting report. There seem to be Grey Wardens who survived Ostagar. How, I don't know. But they will act against you. I have arranged for a, a solution, with your leave. The Antivan Crows send their regards. An assassin? Against Grey Wardens, we will need the very best, <laughs> And the most expensive. Just get it done. So we got assassins sent after us now. Logan, not taking any risks. Well, let's see what happened to us. Uh, I'm gonna save this because I remember this fight from my other playthrough, and it actually got a little bit hard. And plus, the game glitched out. So if it glitches out here, I'm just gonna call it. Um, let's go see what these guys want. Ah, a fellow traveler of the Fair Lands. Are you a seeker, perchance? My packs are light, but I have a tome of strange origin. The Deus V. Eternus, rumored to be the last message to a sinful world from the Maker himself. So, if you... I didn't go and look it up, but we found some notes that these uh, guys had it in the Circle Tower. So I'll ask him. I have you uh, no idea there. what you're talking about, and uh, neither do these large men carrying swords. Get them! Yep. So it's Something a fight. I'll fight to the leader. But there's quite a few of them. So I'm hoping. Oh, I've been frozen. Uh, when can you give me a heal when you're up? Because I see you get knocked down. He got knocked down too. I think everyone got hurt. Actually, when should do a group heal now? They won't know what hit them. I can't move. Group heal, sweet. But Alice is getting fucked. At your order. He needs a health holder. And my guy is still fucking frozen. Um. Make his breath. These guys are almost dead. Except for that dude. I'm. Holding off the other dude despite not being able to move. There we go. Oh, I need a health focus. Knock down. Oh, shit. See, this is what I mean when it gets tough at times. Uh, I'll give her a health focus. I was on Liliana there, but now I'm back to my character. Fucking fireballs are pissing me off. Looks like he sent another one at me. These thugs are almost dead. I'll get on it. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? Bam! You resisted. All right, all right. Let's see if ah, she's using stupid shit. She should be um, just go. healing. Or whatever, oh, kill this fucker, and then let's get these mages up top. Now, Alice is getting one of them. Let's try to do a shield bash. Oh, let's kill Alistair. But. It's okay. Killed them all. Some death root here. Oh, Alistair's like back, so I'm gonna give him a uh, not like death much. Lesser injury kit. The 
This mage has a lightning rune. Let's take a quick look around for any other uh, herbs. Yeah, that's a pretty tough battle at this lower level. Um, and there's no way to avoid it. Like, I couldn't say anything. I couldn't persuade him. Nothing. So if you look, there's all these X's on the radar. It usually means something important. Like, something that's either not there usually. Like this uh, uh, overturned tree. Or an entrance or exit, which is over here. And these rocks blocking it. There's also the death route up here. There's something over here as well. We'll go search this one out. And then we we'll check these bodies over here. And no one has anything but the main dude. He had a dagger, a cowl, and some money. And we can take it all, thankfully. So nothing else it seems. And this is the way out. So yeah. Tough battle. I didn't want to use up all those poultices, but whatever. Ooh, it's caravan over there. So we made it to Red Cliff Castle. Let's go. Ooh, I don't know if I should cut this video or not. We'll try and get it all in. Basically, we just got to go in and get these. Uh, actually, I'll cut it here. Um, we'll probably need some talking. A lot of talking, so we'll cut it when we get back. We'll enter the castle, and we'll try and heal their Connor. I think we're trying to save, as well as um, our Lehman. But if you enjoyed Lehman, like, comment, subscribe. Thanks. Bye.